Hey everyone. Now, <clears throat> I know for one that I'm not one much of a person to, to look to talk to say like a face the camera all the time. But fuck it, I'm gonna have to go with this one either way. So, I did know talking about the past and why I hate the left, right? Well, I used to say about that one that I, that I was going to do like a, a video that why that I mean I used to be a Democrat, but uh, that uh, I was gonna say like I'll do like some other time, but guess what? I'm gonna do that fucking right now. Because why? Because I fucking want to. Like I said, despite the fact that I'm not uh, one for, to talk more for uh, a webcam to face all the time, but fuck it. Now, <clears throat> for once, I mean, bit of a prologue. It's uh, it's quite a bit of a it's quite a bit of a long story. So I mean, I'm gonna have to try to reduce it as uh, as much as I can. So, again, for the prologue. So there I was. I was thinking clearly, with my mind off the off the med of the prescription medicines. With my mind filled with hatred, I was able to think clear, and so I figured I was. Uh, I was trying, and I tried to wonder, why was I so, was I so punished all the time? And that's when I knew that I was about being abused by the Democrats and the liberals and the communists. But then that, but then that's when I realized they were all the same. <laughs> now, jokes aside, I mean, uh, so jokes aside, is is something that I've been uh, that I had to do for quite a bit of a uh, for quite a bit of while. Uh, first off, is uh, it always going to say ever since you know when I was like a bit of a bit of a small child, I was you know always in schools. I mean that I grew up. There were always the, the liberal schools. What I mean by that, it's simple. Is that uh, the schools, I mean, that they, they were, you know, it was been as mostly for of a uh, liberal lean, let's say. Sure, I mean, it was, uh, there was, uh, there were some good teachers, some bad teachers, like any other, in, in, any other normal school would have. It's, uh, I have to say, it's, uh, quite a bit of a, of an interesting point, I would say so, for one. Because, due to the fact that, uh, you would first expect, you know, like, it would, uh, you know, they were always stand up saying like, a, "Oh, liberalism." Despite the fact that I don't agree with what you're saying, I'll fight for the right for you to defend it. Now, that's a funny thing about it. There are sure, sure, there's some people that go about it, but uh, some people that use about this as an excuse, like, uh, "Oh, you're offending me. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna censor the shit out of you." Why? Because I can. I look emotionally dead. I just realized in the webcam. How dead does this look? Yeah. I look so alive. I look like I'm so happy. I could basically, uh, I don't know. I'm. <laughs> I don't feel happy at all. I, I, I admit that. So I mean, <clears throat> I'll, uh, I'll. So like I was saying as well too, like because for one, I mean, I was grew up, you know, with a school. Sure, I mean, there was a lot of teachers around that they could, let's say, like a. Hmm, I see you're having trouble with this little mathematical equation. Let me sit by your side and so we can figure this out. Sure, there's a lot of teachers that were very caring about it, but I mean, some of the teachers just like, uh, here, let me write some shit on the wall, let me give you some books, and fuck you, you can you can study it. I don't give a shit about it. And sure as well, too, like, there was uh, some students that were taking some very bad grades, like, and he was always going like, hmm, you're taking some bad grades. Well, guess what? It's your fault. You didn't, you, you didn't even study. It's your fault. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> Actually, not all that aggressive, but hey, you can you can basically uh, get a bit of a idea how it, how it is. So, yeah, I mean, it's basically uh, you know, it wasn't basically all that uh, ooh and whatnot, all that happy as I used to. Uh, I mean, as it as it used to say. I mean, not just me, uh, like uh, as they as they say. So then again, I mean. <clears throat> So then again, no, it's more towards like a high school that I kind of got a bit of a glimpse, you know, and uh, what the really uh, the left wing is or whatnot. So basically, this goddamn glass I can't stop sliding out, can they? <clears throat> so as I was saying, is that uh, those people, you know, back then, I mean, at the high school, I kind of got a bit of a glimpse on what they are, especially you know that uh, they were, let's say, more uh, authoritarian for one. I mean, for one, let's say. There was, let's say, this kind of student that sits all on the back of the classroom, right? He's like a, 
One second. He's like just fucking listening to music, uh, watching porn in his iPhone, or something like about that, right? Well, guess what? The teacher, he uh, ignores him completely. He can do whatever the fuck he wants because the teacher said so. And then there's me. I, st I you know, copy everything that that that, uh, that the teacher puts on the board. And here am I listening to music. Guess what he does? He baps, he uh, punishes me. For maybe, I don't know, it was maybe the kind of music I was listening to because uh, I like to listen to myself quite a lot about Judas Priest, uh, Iron Maiden, Motorhead, all that, all that good stuff. <laughs> but the uh, thing is, it's basically just the fact that it's the... You know, it's uh, quite a bit you know, like a selective how they how they work, and uh, you know, especially you know how what they say like a, uh, oh, this guy here, yeah, you know, even though the fact that our school is completely uh, stressful, we're just gonna mark him with autism, even though there's no medical proof about that, but he's gonna pull go on medication because we want to. I mean, I don't know why they would go about that, but. Uh, well, the main city, well, the city, you know, that I used to go through for, for quite a while, I mean, the people over there were just not open, because for one, say, you say, like, a, hey, neighbor, good morning, right? And they just say the same thing back. Well, guess what? I mean, if, you, I mean, you're in the, you're, let's say, walking, let's say, on the shopping, or whatever it would be, you know, you just walk past those guys, just, like, just walk away, just, they just wouldn't pay the attention to you. It's like you're not even there. It's like, a, mm, I gotta work, mm, gotta work. Uh, can't give a shit for anyone else. They're all competition. I gotta work. I gotta be the best. <sighs> but of course, I mean. But of course, I mean. I just, I'm just uh, exaggerating for the for the bit. Now another because you know back then, you know, like when they just put on medication for me. Now that shit, you know, was just uh, altering, you know, the behavior of a, a child, you know, from. If it was bad, you know, to work because that shit, you know, as I can and I can tell by experience, it doesn't work. I mean, it it it, it doesn't work at all. Sure, there's like the the mood stabilizers and there was this or that. I think it was mood stabilizers back then I used to take, but uh, that's but that shit worked on me like a mood destabilizer, and uh, it affected you know quite a lot. You know my my uh, social skills and whatnot, despite the fact that people still like. Uh, I should you should you should be more open. You should try to make more friends and whatnot, right? Despite the fact that I had shit poor, uh, open skills back then, kind of had to grow out mine out the hard way. But hey, it was what it was, and uh, and yeah, I mean at least it worked out to some extent. At least uh, at least the hard way, even better more than than uh, those way that they were trying to make me go for as well. <clears throat> yeah. So. So back then, you know, like it was just quite a bit of a very nasty uh, from there on out because the more medicine, the more medication I take, the more I—I I mean, I wasn't myself, and those bastards got, got me kicked out of school repeatedly. And yeah, it felt good, you know, to be kicked out of some some small-time bullshit. I mean, it's funny how those guys—they can make like a a problem this size make something about like this big for no goddamn reason. And yeah, and yet they can actually screw you over because of it. But uh, no, like that's been you know like a bit of a, a bit of a thing about it, right? Because sure, I mean even you know in the supermarket there's some just have some old hag and just go like, uh, he's too slow. I'm gonna cut him the way. Yeah, I'm in, I'm in the line. Yeah, I'm gonna put my my products over here. Yeah, you you're not gonna, you're not going to uh, you're not, you're not gonna go first first. I mean even though you can cut your way. Like yeah, fuck you. Yeah, fuck you. Yeah, fuck you. Fuck you. I'm just gonna put myself over here. Yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna pay for it. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm just I'm just exaggerating, of course. I'm just exaggerating. <sighs> Yeah, because, you know, like, there's a lot of, I mean, I always like to exaggerate for the comic value, just because, you know, it's, uh, it's the only way I can cope, you know, with the anger that I, that I, that I, that I carry along, that I carry along with me, all the anger, I, I guess, keep along, so I'll probably, you know, just wait till too long, I, yeah, I should just probably, you know, see some, say, for this eye here, but like I was saying as well, too, is because, uh, I mean, I don't know, I mean, it also got the, the point, no way, those motherfuckers, they got me, and they locked up in a mental hospital, and for what? Oh, I know, maybe because, of, maybe because of that time, I just finished taking my medication, 
I was still recovering then come that self egotistic bitch makes a makes a small complaint of something this fucking small comes an ambulance at the school and they lock me up. I get it. I fucking get it. You lock me up because of a small mistake. Fucking asshole. I get it. Anyways. Anyways, I mean, it's, it's kind of... It, anyways, you know, I kind of get a bit of a wake-up call from there. Because of the fact, you know, like, uh, I've always, you know, been, been, been circulating in my head all the time. I mean, why was I always punished for the smallest things? Why? I mean, I do something wrong and I get... I get punished like maybe like I did some shoplifting, but I didn't. And but I get punished the way because of it. But why? Huh? But fucking why? Well, I know it. Oh, well, I know for sure. It's because if I and not, I mean it's not just me as well because I'm with some other people. But I can tell you why. It's because they hate you. They want you to die. They don't see you as a human being. They see you as a piece of shit who deserves it to fucking die. Huh? Eh? I get it. <sighs> I fucking get it. That's a bit about as well too, you know. In many ways, how uh, <clears throat> how some in some ways, you know, you you, you let say you give everything, you know, to, to the people. You show as much love as you can, but even though they just come around, just slap it off your slap it off your face and all the love because hey, I mean, yeah, they like yeah, this guy, he's competition. He uh. We don't want him here. Just let's just get rid of him. We, we don't want him. Just get rid of him. He's competition, or at least at least that's how I see it. I don't know. I mean, because you know, at some point I'm always, you know, I always, you know, got in the back of the head like, uh, yeah, that guy was there. Yeah, we hate him. We don't like him over here. Fuck him. Just fuck him. Anyways, like I was saying as well too, is that uh, uh sorry, he's just. Just kind of got to get a bit of a. I just man, just like uh, lose a bit of a conscience for a bit. But hey. But hey, I say. There's not much in Noah that can be can be actually too uh, seen too much about it. I mean, shit. I even even you know like said, well, the point you nowhere. Know, uh, even the same school you know Noah, those motherfuckers locked me up in a mental hospital. Yeah, the same those same assholes. I went away and I went to like a, a video game of design. Well, guess what? It really doesn't matter if I'm making friends, if I'm taking some good grades or whatnot. Those motherfuckers are gonna kick you out. And why? Because they fucking want to. They don't like your face. I mean, ah, uh, that guy though is is a big man. Yeah, he's so masculine. Uh, let's get. I don't like him. Let's just kick him out the plug him over here on the skull. I don't. I don't, I don't like him. And I mean, it's, it's not just because of that, because, because when I was doing that fucking course, <sighs> I kind of had a bit of a bit of an outburst in the like, Grand Theft Auto, but I used to have some flashbacks about it. But you know, it was that kind of asshole who was always blasting out shitty YouTube videos out loud, whether it be in a break room class, and he was a say pill and said like, uh, uh, yeah, this is this is a fun part. Uh, you're gonna laugh at this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've been to the I've been to the, the, the theme park and just killed the living buck shit buck fitch out of me. And it's this kind of asshole, you know, that kind of that I had to go through on a daily fucking basis, on a daily fucking basis. And not to mention, well, too, like this asshole has been getting he's been getting far more aggressive. Close the fucking door. Is this asshole has been kind of has been getting far more aggressive to you know the teachers and everyone else? And guess what? The teacher, I mean, I mean, of course, even the teachers couldn't do anything about it. They were tired of it, sure, they were. But guess what? We complained several times. The fucking director, and she didn't do just jack shit about it. Just jack shit about it. There's nothing about it to be done. Seriously. What the fuck was I paying uh, more than a fucking me and my family paying more than a fucking thousand dollars for a lot for what? I was this close to to, to having this. I mean, I was seriously this close to going about it. But guess what? Have I got anything about it? Oh wait, that's right. I got nothing. I'm still here at my own at, at my own home. I got no job, no 
certification or anything, despite the fact that I was this close to getting it, this fucking close I was to, uh, to getting about it. But I couldn't. Because of some slob, some slobby potato ass autistic motherfucker. And uh, those fucking liberals, I'd say. Fucking Democrats. Fucking whatever else we want to call them. Fucking progressives. Fucking globalists. Whatever the fucking hell. I don't give a shit anymore. The only care, the only thing I care about is actually getting, getting some, getting my, getting something done, you know, in my life. Be it, you know, some YouTube videos and make at least someone laugh. Be, you know, let's see if I actually can make a product or anything. But fucking can I? No, I can't. No, I fucking can't. And of course, some people say, I should say like, ah, oh, you should take those guys to court or anything. But I am not, I'm not in fucking position to do that, so... So those fucking thugs, I mean, they're just gonna get away with it. But hey, I mean, there's this just a little unfair, you know, calling calling them thugs because that is the left wing nature for you. They lie, they cheat, they steal. It kind of feels like that the best thing that, that they are in life is to to evade taxes and and just steal money from people in any illicit way they can. That's that's how at least I feel like that is going so far. And uh, they fucking hate you because. Because you are who you are. They fucking hate you. They're not who they want you to be. You're you're who you are. They fucking hate you about it. It's uh it's a bit of a dreadful thing that I have to live for. Doesn't matter how close you are to success, how close you are to getting to, to get to good shit in your life done, there will always be some left wing asshole motherfucker who's just gonna put his his tail in the way. Watch you, watch you tip over and fall in a bunch of stairs just so he can laugh and virtue signal at your own pain. I get it. I fucking get it. Well, anyways, I'm done for now. Maybe he's just gonna play some games or I don't know. Well, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this one. I'll hope to see you guys next time. So, see you guys next time and until then, I guess.